In this video, I will be showing you how to create glowing neon illustrations using the free digital drawing software called Medibang. For this tutorial, I will be using a black background so that the glowing effect will be more pronounced. The first example that I will show you is how to create glowing words. Start by going to the text tool. Choose which font you would like, the size of your text and what colour the writing should be. For this example, I will use a bright neon green. Now the text tool on Medibang isn't that crash hot because you can't freely change the size of the text with the simple transform tool. You have to change the size of the text layer by using the text tool. But there is a very easy way of changing the text layer into an image layer. All you need to do is copy the text layer and then paste it. Now the text layer will be an image layer, which will allow you to change the text using the transform tool. Just don't forget to delete the text layer after you have the image version. Now let's transform this open into a glowing neon open. To begin with, copy and paste the image so that there's two layers of the same thing. I will change the names of the layers to open one and open two so it's easier to tell them apart. Now what you want to do is go up to the filter tab, which is way up in the top and go all the way down to Gaussian Blur. This will bring up a little pop-up in which you can play around with how much of the filter you would like. I prefer using the filter to 100% capacity. Once you are happy with the filter, press OK and now you have a glowing neon text. Now there's just one last thing to do before it's complete. You now just have to combine the two open layers using this button here. Now you have one layer with the open image. Now I'm going to do the same technique again, but with a red closed text. With the open image, we used the second layer for the filter. For this red closed image, I will use the first layer. As you can see, it doesn't matter which layer you put the filter on. Both layers equal the same results. Now let's try something a bit different. Let's make this light bulb glow as if it has actually light coming out of it. I only want the glass bulb to be glowing, so I will use the select tool to highlight the bulb and then I'm going to copy and paste the selected area, not once, but twice, so that there's now three layers of the light bulb. This is because we are going to put the Gaussian blur on two layers to make the light bulb glow even more. On one layer, I'm going to put the Gaussian Blur on two times, and you will notice the glowing effect increases in volume every time. Now on the next layer, I'm only going to put the filter on once, which will brighten the whole light bulb and make it really look like there's a source of light coming from it. 
and there you have it. Hopefully this tutorial was helpful and has taught you how to use the Gaussian blur filter to create a neon glowing effect.